All right, guys, welcome back to Tomb Raider 3. So we're on the second level in Nevada, which is the high security compound. As I showed last time, uh, we've lost all our weapons and ammo. Every, everything we gathered, basically, we've lost it all. Because, yeah, these devs were evil. So, yeah, we're trapped in this room to start off with. Which is actually, for like a prison, it's, it's a pretty spacious room. I don't know what's going on. Look at the size of that bed. That's not that bad. Anyway, no toilet roll, though, is it? Anyway, uh, what I want to do here is I want to jump into this little window area. We might just be able to make out there is some uh, green beams there. Especially that's going to trigger security to come in. But yeah, we have nothing to fight him with, so... You know, quickly try and run out here and uh, hit the switch. You know, my club here once or twice, but uh, I should have released uh, a prisoner, and well, he should take care of him. I right, can press this one as well. My no prisoner, yeah, and they'll take care of the guard for you. That's something we'll be uh, utilizing a little bit throughout this level, since we ain't got no weapons ourselves. Why not let these guys do all the work? Anyway. Let's swing on over to this side. There's some more uh, doors we can open. I don't think there's any guys in these ones. It's just the ones on the other side. I don't know there's a guy in there. I don't know what he's trying to do. He's trying to escape through that window there. Good luck with that, buddy. Anywho. What we need to be doing is... Heading into this uh, bottom room uh, right here. Basically, the diagonal from where we just came from. See, there's a hole in this wall for some reason. What I do is head up here and uh, push this block. Come on, Lara. All right, I'll reveal a crawl space we got here, so we'll head on through here. And then another one here. Same again. And then we're going to push this block forward to reveal another block I'm going to go ahead and push this one I'm push this one twice to reveal another uh, little space right there we're not going to go through that what we're actually going to do now is we're going to pull this one back back twice there we go okay now we're gonna crawl on uh, back through here and through this one around to where we basically just pulled this block from and where it was boom we're gonna find our first secret the uh, first of two yeah there's only two secrets uh, on this level so a uh, small med pack right there. All right, now we're going to uh, climb on up here. Oh. Okay. So. Big ass jump over there. Oh, yeah, I made it. I usually don't make that jump. <laughs> but, yeah, watch the barbed wire there. And then we're just going to walk on through this barbed wire. Now this technique does not work in real life, so do not attempt it. One end well. Right, yeah, so at the end there we'll hit that switch. That's just going to have opened up the floor we just crossed. I'm going to hop on up here and then uh, down to this uh, gravel wall. Good old drop, drop grabbage. 
careful though you don't go all the way down because there is some barbed wire at the bottom there you can't really see it because the shadows but just want to climb out here to the left like so go forward here and then we will drop down here and uh straight ahead there and there was go just let him walk on i don't want to get his attention just yet you may notice it says MP on these guys' uniforms, if you're wondering what that means. It uh, stands for Massive Pedophile. 100% true. 100% true. <laughs> Alright, when he's buggered off down there, let's swing around here. And we will hit this switch. Which will allow uh, some prisoners to come on through and deal with that guy. Come on, boys. When you're ready. He's also clearly blind. I did not see Laura there. Come on, do him in. Do him in. Alright. So once that guy gets dropped. Will have left some goodies behind, which includes another massive key card, a box of shotgun shells, and a small med pack. So we'll scoop all that up. Go ahead and use the key card on this reader right here. Try to put this kid on through, and then we'll take a right here. I'm gonna still the long way around. I always get confused in these corridors. Go just come straight down here and turn left. <laughs> it's fine. Go ahead and uh, hit the switch to open this door. Take it into this uh, bathroom. Hit the switch to open the door on the other end. And I've got a nice bit of tedious uh, block maneuverage. So basically, this block here, we want to move it all the way over here to this corner so yeah first thing we're gonna want to do is we're gonna go around this side and we're gonna pull it down we're gonna swing them around and we're gonna push it from the other side into the corner nope Lara you need to push not climb Thank you. Alright. And then when it's in this corner, we're going to swing on back rounds. And then we're going to pull it back. And then I'm going to swing back round again and push it. It's up against the wall in the corner. Then swing back around again. Isn't this so much fun? I'm gonna pull it back. I'll tell you what, you'll never hear anyone say in the history of ever that their favorite thing about Tomb Raider is pushing blocks. Never been said. I'm telling you, never been said. Anyway, I'm gonna hop on over and then pull it back. Climbing over. Finally, she into the corner. Laura! Laura, I really need you to worry me today, okay? I mean, none of your bullshit. Okay? I'm sick of her. Alright. Now we got it where we want. We can climb on up. To this area up here. This funky purple room. And jump over this pipe. You said then done. Alright, then to win this little alcove, we've got a switch, we'll go down and hit that. That's gonna be, that's gonna uh, flood that room we just climbed up from. Gonna head on back in. Time for a swim. So just gonna swim up to this corner here. And climbing out.
Okay. Now, watch out for this uh, drop here. You don't want to fall onto uh, those flames. So, hop on over. Or run on over. Whichever <laughs> one. Alright. More big ass jumps over the barbed wire. Down here. Let's go on over. Uh, another switch. Go ahead and hit that. That will basically put the, uh, the flames out we just saw there. Go ahead and hit the switch. Just gonna open this door right here. There we just came from recently. We're not going to go through. We're going to climb on back up. Back over the barbed wire. Now we can drop down here. And it's safe. Some giant storm or something is meant to be. I don't know. Anyway, on here. We've got a small med pack. I'll go ahead and grab that. I'll open this door here. Get around. There's a garden here. We'll open that door just yet. We're gonna open this one first. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little bit easier. Yeah. Now we'll open this one. As soon as we do, the uh, guards gonna come running out. Let's do a quick run. I'm gonna lure him back to uh, where those prisoners are so they can take care of him. Oh, he's on my tail. Hey, 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 this man's got speed. Whoa! Easy! Help! Where my boys at? There they are. Come on, take care of him. Come on, it's for you. Do him in. Don't run around in circles. I need him dead. <laughs> the AI is the AI is really bad. Anyway, cheers, lads. Anyway, you'll go ahead and drop a small med pack as well. We'll grab that right there. Okay. Yeah. Which one is looking for the uh, big mess all there? Here it is. Okay. So we want to head on. Through here and then straight ahead. Push the switch. So that's gonna open an area uh, in that kitchen. Which is just around here. Let's go up here with these uh, propeller <laughs> things. Yeah, blue walk in between them. He does it. The heel is still there. Alright. Now we want to get ready to jump. We slide down here and uh, grab onto that, uh, that little gap straight ahead if you can see it. Like that. Okay. Then there is, there is barbed wire down there in the middle. So you don't want to drop off. Alright. We want to get ready to jump because we're going to slide down here. Go. And then we can climb on into here. Alright. Let's climb all the way up here.
this gentleman. He's going to be kind enough to uh, open this bit here. So let's jump on up. There we go. Climb up here and then climb up here. Right. So there's a guard patrolling up top there, which are just behind us. So a small med pack, we'll grab that. Where is he? to go back to the uh, left so I'm going to be going up and right go let's do a quick runner all this round I'm going to drop on all the way down here the bottom and then we're gonna press the switch release another person there. is there two guys in there I thought there was two guys in there I guess just one anyway he'll go ahead and uh, take care of that guard we just passed Dropped one of those giant key cards again. I still don't know why they have to make them so big. <laughs> it upsets me actually. Anyway, right, we use that key card on here. What's up? So I'm just tucked away in the corner here. We've got uh, a large man pack and some Uzi ammo. And we also got this button right here I want to press. So that's going to switch off the uh, green lasers you might have seen, which were around this corner. I'm pretty sure you hit those, they'll um, trigger this gun up there. I'll show you. Pretty sure that's what happens. Although I could be wrong, I can't remember. Alright, we're going to drop down here. I'll drop and grab. Works wonders every time. Okay. Right, there's a guard there. He has a key card, so I have to get someone to take care of him, so we hop on down here. I'll open this door to release another prison. Oh, this was the. Okay, that, that had the two guys, so, so I was confused that last bit. Just the one guy. Don't worry about that area there. This guy's uh, go to take care of the. Oh, there you go. Nice one, lads. Alright, so he's. Uh... Well, it's not actually dropped a key card, it's another sort of key. A yellow security pass, it's called. It's a weird looking thing, but that's what we need. So, anti aircraft gun over there. Yeah, can I use this key on this thing here? Yep. Like some sort of stealth fighter thing in there. Get the same aircraft we saw in that last uh, level. down there but we're gonna crawl on through here oh 
So we're gonna drop down here and I'll be kinda quick about this. We wanna we want him to see us basically. He's gonna start shooting so we wanna quickly get out of his uh, line of sight and uh, once he says we're gonna, we also wanna run over and hit that switch as soon as we can before he comes around. Could have been a little bit quicker there, wasn't the best. He got a few shots in mean, the cheeky bastard, but basically that uh, you pull that and it um, makes a uh, red laser appear. That's pretty much what killed him. And it'll kill you too if you, uh, if you touch it. So I'm going to hop on over here. And I'm basically going to uh, jump over it. It's kind of hard to judge where exactly it is. It's it's kind of weird. They're so easy to miss. You just land dropping dead and not knowing what the hell happened. It's happened to me many times in this level, so... There we go. Will be instant death if you touch it. Yeah, that jump. Correct. Alright. Let's follow this path through. Right, no, I'm just gonna walk right to the edge here. Careful not to uh, fall off. I'm gonna jump and grab uh, that ledge up top. It's got this big funky satellite dish thing on it. Go on past it. And I'm gonna drop down here. Alright, if we turn around, let's see, we gotta. Uh, an area right here which I'm going to attempt to jump to so I position myself sort of right sort of in front of this step and at an angle and jump from here, from here and hopefully I'll land right in it there we go all this walk way around drop on down into here on the wall right here, we're gonna switch, we're gonna hit that. Just gonna move that satellite dish up top, revealing a little hole. That's basically where we had him. Open this door here. just below where the uh, satellite thing is so again jump and grab then we're gonna uh, drop down this hole but we're gonna be kind of careful how we uh, drop down so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come to this side of it and this is gonna like try and hop on hop on back and drop down so I had a little bit of a bounce there which is what I wanted so I didn't go drop directly down. Basically, the reason for that is so I didn't uh, go straight down that hole in the middle. Because you don't want to do that. There is a propeller thing down there that can kill you. I've dropped down before and that's killed me immediately. I've dropped down before, but I've not been killed by that. But I've just got stuck because I just can't swim back up. So you want to avoid going down the hole. Then you are going to get a bit of resistance as you uh, come down here. Someone's going to police this one. Uh, sort of swim law. Then move forward, and then you should be able to swim up, grab onto uh, from here. Yeah, that's the uh, it's the hole. It's just it's directly underneath me. There it is. You basically don't want to land down there. That's why I went down the way that I did. It usually works for me. Anyway, we're gonna hop on over to here. Jump. This bit here, let's watch out for these slopes. So slide on back into the water. Alright. Jump off this platform here. And I'll jump over to here. And then I'm gonna jump 
up to this uh, little bit here, this green area. There we go. Okay, so let's crawl on through here. Follow this round. Switch there. Back for a swim. I'll swim on through here. Small med pack on the way. Grab that. Right. Watch out for the guard walking past here. Walk from the left. Sneak on through. Oh. That there. Follow this round. Uh, right, now we do need the key for that. Um, Going up here just yet. Pick this one. Start right. this round. To a little ladder. Right, want to be careful of the guard up top, so I'm just going to uh, walk best to not get his attention. There it is, back to us, to the left. Just kind of sneak on over here. Climb up onto this little gap. And then back here we got another key. So we'll grab that. And we're going to sneak on back out. It just makes life a bit easy if you, if, you know, remain undetected and after you're trying to shoot you. Alright, head on back down. Here. Okay. Now we can uh, use the key we just got on here. 
Yeah, so that just blocked off the uh, fan propeller thing that's uh, down the hall there in the middle of that uh, that main room with the water. So that's where we're heading. So now we can head up here, which I did earlier. So uh, get us back to that room. All right, so let's swim on down. Heel crystal there. Bit of a long swim here, so kind of got to be quick about this. Should we don't drown? You will do if you muck around too much. Right, just under here. Yay! Box of flares. Still had to panic because I had no flares. Look at all those flares I lost. Oh, devastated. Yeah, I'm never going to ship out those flares. Anyway, right, hit that lever. Go up here and then up here. There's a small med pack. All right, now, very carefully as we swim up top. They're all lasers. Swim over here to this corner. Catch my breath. Okay, there we go. So I can show you lasers. Kind of hard to see, but there's three of them straight ahead. Got a yellowy color to them. Getting the all hard to see. Alright. Swim on under. Then we're going to resurface on this side again. Watch out, we don't hit the lasers. Okay. Seem a bit clearer there. There they are, sort of slap bang in the middle. Alright, jump on over here. Down to this bit of water. Let's uh, swim through this tunnel. I'm <sighs> out here. Dude, there, just chilling out. Alright. Yes, we're uh, going to climb over these boxes here. I'm going to hit this switch to open the door. Which, finally, will take us uh, to a place where we can finally get a, get a gun. So, a little large med pack. Reclaim the pistols right there. So, yeah, we're finally armed again now. Just sneaking around. Bollocks. And we've also got the Desert Eagle there with some ammo. Yeah, there we go, we've got 30, 30 bullets right there. Alright. <laughs> Even though I knew it, I nearly ran straight into it right there, I got so lucky. Yeah, once you've grabbed those, these lasers are going to be, you see in the three green lasers, they're going to trigger a gun up top. So, just want to just walk around the corner here. Should be able to squeeze on through without hitting them. I don't know why I do stuff like that. Oh wait, yeah, I do, because I'm an idiot. Anyway, <laughs> climb back over these boxes. And then we're heading back. to the uh, that main open room with a wall. So again. Careful of the lasers there, we jump back in the wall. And back on through here. Basically, gonna make our way around back. 
for that uh, crawl space there. Hit the switch again to uh, open that door. All right, now we're heading back. Once again, swim through this tunnel. Is this guy uh, chilling through here? Well, now we got his guns. I'll tell you what. We test out our uh, desert eagle. Yeah, that's right. That yeah, feels good to be able to shoot again. Down in two shots. Right. Okay, so we're going to climb up here again. This ladder. It's back to where we snuck past that guard and uh, got that key. Burn him down. Alright, and he's going to drop the giant key card and some grenades right there. And we run straight ahead. Actually, go ahead and use the key card on this. Open up this door, and boom! There's the second secret, and the uh, the final secret. As there's only two uh, secrets in this level, and we got the grenade launcher. We got six rounds. Good stuff. Right. Now we're going to be uh, backtracking again. Back to the uh, main room with the water. Actually, can we take a shortcut straight down here? Drop on down. Alright. And yeah, we're going back down here again. Follow this all the way through. Here again. Again. Well, make sure we avoid them uh, lasers there in the middle. Jump on over. Swim on through here. Oh, man, oh, so back uh, in this area where we climbed over them boxes to uh, get my 
pistols and the uh, Desert Eagle. Right. So he's gonna mess around here somewhere. Not sure where he is. There was a guy there, but anyway, we're gonna go up here. We are gonna have a bit of company. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, use the Desert Eagle. But I would recommend be a little bit cautious with the Desert Eagle ammo I use. I think it's wise to save it. Especially to, for the very end of the game. Um, it would be wise to do so. so I'll tell you what. I will switch uh, back to the pistols. Maybe I'm being all, all, overly cautious there, but... There is quite a few guys here, and... Having all come out here and get a little messy. Okay. I don't think any of these guys drop anything. Oh no, I'm sorry, of course I do. Uh, one of them drops a key we need. Make sure you grab that. And then in here, there is a large med pack. And, oh god. I'm a dog. I hate having to kill the dogs, I really do. <laughs> I'll kill people all day long, but not a problem or anything else. Make me kill dogs, I'm not happy. Especially since I'm pretty sure they're meant to be German Shepherds. And I have a German Shepherd, so it makes it that much, much worse. Alright. Let's climb on up here. Here's the key that we uh, just picked up on this right here. guy in here, so fire away. And we've got a couple of switches in here we want to press. We'll hit this one. That's going to open the gate up top. We've got another dog coming. God damn it! And a guy. Get ready for those. And then we've got a switch right here. Let's press this one, which is going to get that conveyor moving. It's going to shift those boxes. It's right below us now, so get ready. Okay. Alright, now let's uh, head back down to the uh, first bit of this area. Oh, there's that prisoner. Sure, he was hiding before. Yeah, we need a key, basically, to open that gate right there. But uh, since we activated that conveyor, this box has moved here, so we can now climb on up. It's right. gonna. Grab on here and uh, gonna head uh, straight, uh, straight forward here because there's a small med pack on that platform. You may have seen uh, one of the guys up top. We'll deal with him in a moment. Oh, let's grab that. Let's jump on back up. Here. All right. Oh. 
Oh, he's shooting at me. Excuse me, sir. Where is he? A bit of damage there, let's just quickly heal up. Make sure I win this good fight. Yeah, that's right. That's right, that's what you get. Alright, anyway, he's dropped the key we need. Snag that. And there is a heal crystal uh, over here. Alright, gonna drop back down here. Just gonna hang in there, uh, drop back down the floor there. Alright. Use the key we just grabbed to open this gate here. To the left. Let's put him down. Head into this uh, warehouse thing over here. It's gonna be another guy. Put him down as well. Kill him dead. Before we uh, end this level, got something down here. Yeah, we got some uh, Desert Eagle ammo and a small med pack right there, so be sure to grab that. Alright, and then let's get out of here. Where did that can come from? Anyway, yeah, there you go. That's that level done. Two of two secrets. So, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.